Hi Glenn, Katrina here from the TrackX team. Um, in this short video, I'm just going to show you how you can control the zoom effects as per your email. So in this video here, I actually just have a static JPEG of a screenshot I took from Google Maps. And what I'd like to do is just zoom in on the marker here. So we don't want to zoom out, we just want to zoom in as per your email request. So first of all, I'm going to add in the zoom effect and I'll just drag this out. And the default when you first add it is we go from zero to zoom to zooming out to zooming in to no zoom. So you can see here the first node is zero zoom and the last node is zero zoom. So what I'm going to do first of all is actually just delete this node here. And now if I drag this node out here, and as you can see, we can just bring this to no zoom. So when I roll over the node there, you'll see it says it is at zero. So I'll just grab the cursor here and just bring the play bar across. So you see there's no zoom and then we're zooming in. So we'd like this to be a slower zoom so let's just bring this our play bar over a little bit. We'll bring out our image a little bit and let's bring out the zoom effect and we can control make this slower by bringing this node over. So now when I just grab my cursor to show it you can see that we're just zooming in on the picture. And then I have it here that we're zooming back out to the original size of the image. So that node is at zero. Now, if I'd like this to be a slower zoom, obviously I could make the image longer, bring out the effect, or I can just grab this node here, bring it over a bit. Again, just put it to no zoom. So I'll bring my cursor there, press play, and we can control the speed of the zoom. So here we have it as a very slow zoom into the map. So you can see, so it's really slow into where we've done to zoom to the 100% and then back out to no zoom. And to control the speed of the zoom, we literally can just move the nodes. And obviously, here we're zooming in, but if we wanted to zoom out, obviously we could just bring the node down, and that would be a zoom out. So really, to add zooms and to control them, add your zoom effect, and then use the nodes to control exactly how you'd like to zoom in and out. So in your case, you only want to zoom in, you don't want any zoom out, so we can start at zero zoom, bring it in, bring it out again, or if we didn't want to bring it out at all, we just want to zoom out, just bring my cursor over, we would obviously could just either bring this node all the way up, or we could delete that node and just have the two nodes, so the zero zoom, and then the zoom in by a factor of two. So I hope that makes sense to you. Uh, below this video, I've just shown an example of the zoom in action so you can have a look to see what the rendered version would look like. I hope this makes sense. And if you require any further information, please do not hesitate to contact us. Many thanks.